Kalkat, who is classified as a primordial goddess or a primordial deity. And she was written about in very old Kemetic or North African civilizations culture. She is one of the eight primordial deities of the Ogdua cosmology, and she is representative of the chaos and darkness that existed prior to the creation of the universe. As with all the other of this pantheon, she is paired with a similar deity, who would be Kek, and they appear in anthropomorphic form. Coquette, pictured with the head of a snake, and Kek with the head of a frog. And this, as some would argue, would be a reference to one and zero in binary code. Nan and his wife, Nanette, symbolize the primordial waters. Ha and Ha-het symbolize the eternity of space. And Amon and Amunet represent the invisibility or the hidden force that was the spark. As cosmic gods, they were all represented in in this anthropomorphic form. The pairing of the two represent again the primordial darkness. This is specifically the chaos that existed without light. And thus Kek and Kaket came to represent that aspect of darkness, which symbolize obscurity. But within that darkness was great power and great depth. The deities of the Ogduit cosmology were crucial to the creation of life if you listen to the beliefs of the ancient Kemites. Their machinations generated the original spark that would become the creator and then thus the creation of the universe as we know it. 